Welcome back to Mason Talk. So today we are going to be talking about the Cleveland Cavaliers. Yesterday the Cavaliers played their first preseason game of the year versus the Orlando Magic and the Cavaliers won 117 to 102. Kyrie Irving did not play in yesterday's game. He was resting seeing as he played all of the postseason all the way up to a finals game seven and then also he played in the Olympics so he really hasn't had that much of an off season so the Cavaliers let him rest yesterday the Cavaliers started DeAndre Liggins at point guard which I thought was kind of weird I thought for sure it would be either Kay Felder or Jordan McRae but no it was DeAndre Liggins Tristan Thompson also did not play he was replaced by Chris Anderson so Kyrie Irving and Tristan Thompson both did not play but LeBron and Kevin Love both did play Kevin and LeBron both played 13 minutes LeBron had seven points and six assists and Kevin had eight points and four rebounds. I thought Kevin looked more relaxed and more confident than usual. He was knocking down jumpers. He was driving to the bucket. He just looked more confident than he usually does. And I thought LeBron looked like LeBron, which is good because he's LeBron. Probably the most impressive part of LeBron's game yesterday was the fact that he hit not one, but two jump shots. Over the offseason, LeBron had reportedly been working on his jump shot and he hit two jumpers yesterday, so that was good to see. If LeBron could all of a sudden become a really good jump shooter, that would be great. <laughs> yesterday, we got to see a lot of Kay Felder and Jordan McRae. I thought McRae looked good. He still looked aggressive. He was still driving to the bucket, getting layups. It also looked like Jordan McRae really improved his jump shot over the offseason. McRae was knocking down catch and shoot three pointers. And I think if he keeps that up, and if somebody isn't re-signed by the start of the regular season, I think Jordan McRae should be the starting shooting guard for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Right now, our starting shooting guard is Iman Shumpert. But I think it would make more sense to start McRae. He can spread the floor, and he gives Kyrie and LeBron more room to do work inside. So if McRae keeps shooting well, I think he should be the starting shooting guard for the Cavaliers. I also really liked what I saw from Kay Felder. He brings energy off the bench, he's a very good passer, and he's a pretty good scorer inside despite the fact that he's five foot nine. And he's also a scrappy defender, much like Matthew Delvadova. He's pretty much just a more athletic Matthew Delvadova. So yeah, I liked what I saw from those two. I think Jordan McRae could be a starter, and I think Kay Feller is gonna be a really good player off of the bench. But yeah, so I thought the Cavaliers had a really good game. LeBron and Kevin both looked pretty good. The Cavaliers had really good defense, really good ball movement. And uh, our two young players looked really good. So yeah, it was an overall good game for the Cavaliers. Our next preseason game is Saturday against the Philadelphia 76ers. Sadly, no Ben Simmons, but we will see Joel Embiid, the two-year veteran rookie, whatever. <laughs> but yeah, so I thought it was a pretty good game. Let me know in the comments what you thought of the Cavaliers' performance. Thanks for watching Mason Talks. Make sure you subscribe to Mason Talks for more NFL, NBA, world champion Cleveland Cavaliers, and also Cleveland Browns videos. Make sure you leave a like on this video and I will see you in my next video. Goodbye.